They won't even let us leave this room, Gabrielle. The king? He has lost his mind to grief. First our darling, Sophie. Then our beloved son. My poor sweet angel. They didn't let me say goodbye. I wasn't even allowed to see him. Seraphine, something inside me is, is crying out, telling me he's still of this world at, at times. I think I hear him calling to me. I'm so afraid. What do you fear, my queen? Everything. Everything horrifies me. The king's wrath. His army of indefatigable automats that Monsieur de Vaucanson has built for him. The charlatans who advise him, who are now more powerful than ministers. What happened to my son? What will happen to the children that God has deigned to leave in my care? I won't let any harm come to them. This I promise you. But how? Do you not see that we're prisoners here? All is not lost. You forget about the one automat that is not hostile to us. This new bodyguard of yours. This machine that is now somehow able to speak and understand what we say to it, c'est terrifiant. 
Yes, but it is loyal to you. That's all that matters. If it managed to escape the chateau, it could be your eyes and ears in Paris. And if, perchance, the other automats were to go after it? You won't attempt anything foolish. I cannot lose you, Gabrielle. Not now. Aegis? Madame. The king must be stopped. The very kingdom is at stake. Go and find Vaucanson at his workshop. Ni les invalides. He surely holds the secret to these tireless automats. And perhaps he will know something about the death of my son. How am I to leave the chateau grounds, madame? Go to the riverbank, at the far side of the grounds. From there you can take a boat to Paris. You wanted to find Vaucanson? Vraiment? What if he is the one who is responsible for this unrest? What Vaucanson has done, ma chère, only Vaucanson can undo.